Hi, in this tutorial, I will show you how to select Forminator forms as a trigger and send data to Bit Integrations actions. At first, open the Bit Integrations dashboard. Now go to Forminator forms and create a form or select any exacting form that you have already created. Now go to the Bit Integration dashboard and click on Create Integration button to create an integration. Now select Forminator as a trigger. Select the form from the drop down list that you connect with actions and wait for a few seconds until the next button is active and click on the next button. After completing these steps, the actions will appear on a new page. Now select any action of your preference that you want to integrate with Forminator. I am selecting Google Sheets. Here you can set the integration name of your preference. To get the client ID and secrets open your Google Developer Console. I've already set up everything inside the Google Developer Console and I've already created the client ID and secret. To know how to set up the Google Developer Console to integrate with Google Sheets, read our documentation about the Google Sheet integration link in the description below. Now copy the client ID and secret and paste it into the integration setting. Now click on the authorize button after successfully authorizing and click on the next button. Select the specific spreadsheet from the drop-down menu which you have created before on Google Sheet. Then select the worksheet that belongs to the selected spreadsheet. Now specify the header row. By default, the first row of the worksheet is considered as a header row and click on the refresh button. Now you can map the form fields with the necessary Google Sheets header. After mapping the desired fields, click on Next. To save the integration process, click on Finish and Save. Now go to your form and type some information and submit. After submitting the form, check your form entry. Also, check your Google Sheet. Thanks for watching our video.